Hello everyone, Thanos here, uh, back for another Transformers review with the uh, sidearm sideswipe here. But I want to show these two off because they were both given to me by my very good friend, um, Benita, who is also a, subs a uh, subscriber here on YouTube, so I'll put her link down below. And so I want to dedicate these two videos to you, and I hope you enjoy these videos. So. Here we go. So we're gonna start off with side arm side swipe. So I'm gonna put prime up. Save him for the next round. And so here we have him in a nice little custom Corvette Stingray. And I like the paint job that they gave him. Um, with me being the Star Wars fanatic that I am, the uh, front part here kind of reminds me of the Rebel Alliance symbol. So which is pretty cool. Anyway, um, really, really a lot of panel breakup on here. Just because of all the transformation and everything, it's just it's insane. And one, he has one little nifty feature, which I'm going to make the attempt to do, is you can put his guns, which I've taken out, and you can store them in his vehicle mode and have them deployed in vehicle mode which I'm not going to put them away because it's a pain in the butt to put up so it's kind of like that and here you go and for those of you who remember Twisted Metal that's kind of what it reminds me of a little bit so um, I've only played the, one of the games on the PlayStation but that's what it kind of reminds me of a little bit so yay I take those off here like that and just close up the top parts and just kind of set them to the side. This whole little quick size comparison here he is with Bumblebee here. Uh, just see that he's just a little bit smaller. I think he's actually in scale with Bumblebee. With the actual Camaro of the Corvettes did exist. Well actually, no take that back. This one's just a little bit smaller. So yay alright now to start off with the transformation you want to just take it off to the sides pop the doors, the side panels off this is really a little bit more involved transformation than the other side swipe take these panels to the side as well go and bring this one off to the side as well and then come around here to the bottom part of the car and just bring the legs down and just kind of collapse it. It's kind of like, like an accordion down to where this uh, this peg right here you can see that this peg right there in the middle is going to connect in to this down here. So it snaps in. And then just bring the wheels around here to the front like that and just bring out a little I guess his stands, his foot stands now, so that he can stand up. So here's this one. And then just come around here to the back. Actually, it's kind of a little neat little transformation that they got here. Really ingenious, too, by Hasbro. Now, let me show you here. Bring this on up. Um, right here, you want to twist this around to the... Twist this around to reveal his head. I thought that was pretty, pretty cool of them to do. Just bring this on up, if I can get into it. There we go. Just like that. And just bring his chest piece around. Bring that all around here, all the way over. And then this, uh, this peg is gonna connect to these prongs right here. So I'm just kinda just bring it in. Just snap it on. Yeah, right. Now that I said, it, I didn't hear it, but it's, you know, it did connect. Okay. And just like like that. There we go. Then this back piece. Let's go ahead and um, bring this back piece down like this. And just kind of just according to back down. These side panels. So let's come around to the back. Or choice of preference. 
Another cool little new transformation that they gave him was to bring the front grill to the side like that far enough to where you can actually bring out his hand and that just brings on down like that and just lift up his shoulder and so you have one of his hands done. We'll do that with the same thing with the other side. Bring it down like that and up and here we have sidearm sideswipe in his robot mode and I'll agree with a lot of other people that he is a lot more easier to stand up with these little heels that he has just going to put his guns in here now these guns are specifically molded for this other side swipe uh, for this side swipe here the other one with the swords I uh, can't put them in so which is okay with me I still prefer him with the swords anyway so speaking of which let's bring him into this it's kind of nice little differences here and and whatnot that this side swipe is a bit um, the sidearm side swipe is a bit skinnier than the first side swipe that we got Stand up, you. Okay, you don't just find this one too long as I knock over the other one. Brilliant. There we go. You to stand, and you to stand up. Alright, so. Here is sidearm sideswipe compared to his other counterpart from the movie. Um, you can see a little differences there. But still pretty cool. So I'll go ahead and get him out of the way. And the articulation for this one, uh, arms can go complete 360, you bend at the elbows, and he does have movement on the wrists, no wrist articulation though, or can't swipe up, turn at the wrists, but, and then he also, I guess you want to call these knees back here, so, he does have knee joints, like that, Let's bring them forward a little bit, through like that, so, here we go. And here is sidearm side swipe one more time. And I want to say thank you to my good friend Benita, who I'll have her um, description and link down to the um, description bar down below. Um, she's a very good friend and a very good artist. So if she would like me to, I will put her DA account as well on here. Um, but I'll give you a little 360 view of him. So there you go. Uh, thanks for watching, and I will be back with the Battle Blades Optimus. So I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.